Oh, damn. Well, let's come and see the vegan friendly sign. Let's see what they have. Another restaurant that only gets cow, no cats. Uh, I never came across so many restaurants and places like this that do not take cats. Maybe it's something in Britain. Is this a man riding a bug? How oh, interesting. That's a very cool sitting area outside. Look, it's like school tables. It comes with uh, small tables to eat. I like it. I like this store entrance. Floor is 89. Very flourishy. It's a very colorful polygonal car. Okay, so I stopped at the supermarket to get some water and finally they have like, you know, normal size snacks. Finally, I got some water. I found a big bottle. Keep eyes crazy. The guy on the top looks like Cupid with his bow. Not the biggest section, but at least better than nothing. Here they have Dragon Ball drinks. If I like soft drink, I would take trunks. So many candies though, yeah, but I just left one, so I'm gonna skip this. This one is American candy shop. I do like the windows, so colorful. Oh, and they also have sour patch, which is vegan. Okay, I think I found this, this place called Ventra Vegan. It's supposed to be a fully vegan restaurant. Let's check it out. Is it open? No, it seems closed. Okay, so unfortunately the restaurant seems closed, so I'm gonna check this. Uh, Look like Chinatown. Even go won't turn your tide. Look, it's Pikachu. <laughs> the Pikachu in a tux. <laughs> it look like a train operator. And I would have you anyway. Good. Very dark. I like it. Now look at this statue. It's actually bursting from the wall. I'd always be waiting here. That's cool. Look like a train. I think this is all the show they have on the theater right now. I will keep you in my heart, and I wouldn't change a thing. <laughs> I've been going in circles.
I've never known a brighter side. Okay, so I just got the food. I ordered their not spicy curry along with a little bowl of kimchi. I'm gonna remove those uh, spicy peppers. Hey guys, so the restaurant was extremely loud, so I'm gonna do a voiceover. So let's begin the food review. If I didn't mention earlier, Mildred is a fully vegan restaurant, which is always fun since there's so many options to choose. I took the Kiri hoodie, which is a curry dish. It comes with rice, some sweet potato on top with herbs, almonds, and a mint sauce on the side. And it was delicious. I also wanted to try a kimchi for the first time, so I took it as a side. Uh, unfortunately, I wasn't a fan. The kimchi mostly tastes like a very sour and spicy cabbage. As for the service, it was quite fast and lovely. The waitress was very kind and helped me choose the dish. The place itself is quite packed and loud, yet very cozy with comfortable chairs and lots of plants and a very elegant design. The big downside, they don't get paper cash, so it's not so comfortable for tourists. Oh, and it was also quite challenging to find since there is no big sign outside that marked the place. So overall, I'm gonna give the restaurant 8.5. So this is another restaurant that only gets cows. <laughs> okay, so I'm done with the restaurant. Apparently, no more restaurant get cash. Uh, I feel at this point that uh, getting cash in Britain is completely useless. I'm not sure what I'm gonna do with everything I took out. Anyway, uh, so now I'm gonna head to the National Gallery. Okay, so we once again in this huge M&M store. Let's take a really quick peek. I'm sorry, LA. They didn't want to come. Good one. This is cool. Nice. It's like my Hama Beef Craft, but from M&M. Okay, I'm I'm gonna have a quick stop here, May Sweet Bite. I saw they have some boba tea. Okay, so this is their menu. They have sweet and here are the boba greens. So I took the lychee drink with blueberries and mango bubbles. I with blueberry and mango peas. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, so I just got my drink. It's lychee with mango and blueberries. Uh, tapioca balls. Okay, this is sweet, maybe too sweet for me. I'm gonna give it a three. Not my cup of tea. So very, very sweet, and some of it spill on me. Whee! Oh, extremely sweet. The bobo balls are a bit bitter. Look how cool the noodles there move on its own. <laughs> Japan Center. Wow, look how awesome! It's a huge cream and cherry with a drone and a fly on it. They so got stick to it. And I reached the National Gallery. Not sure if they're gonna let me go inside with this, so I better finish it. Cheers! It's drawing the flags. Oh, and people put coins if you find your own flag. Oh, I see somebody already put in Israel. How cool! So I see so far the USA and I think Ukraine put the most because they want to beat. Let me put some on the back. So many fountains. Okay, let's go to the National Gallery. You see me walking down Fifth Avenue. Walking can't hurt. 
Okay, so here is the free entrance to the gallery. Called where is there is a line. I need to go to the this. Hey, and we're inside. The Van Gogh one is in C and Vermeer is in B. I think I'm gonna start with B. <laughs> she seems like me after a long day of work. Why do babies in those paintings always look scary? I like the folding about this. Okay, so now I'm at Bronzino. I like the tigers. Federico Barucci. You can see the faces are more mushy than the other one. Oh wow, I love the dog expression, it looks so real. Wow, those look so realistic. Look at the details on the face and the form. Those ones are amazing. Lorenzo. Uh, is he holding a header? Wow, she wears such a pretty dress. I think it's the original drawing. Okay, I think I'm now in the children's section. Take one picture. So those are children poses like one of the famous pictures. I think this is the picture it was inspired by. Oh, this is so pretty. I think it's made out of fabric. A huge dream catcher, and I think it's made out of clay. Oh wow, look at those dresses! So cool, it's made out of a children's joint. Wow, I love that. I would wear this. <laughs> Children made such a colorful pieces. So now I'm at the souvenir store. Oh, that's cool. Look at these chess pieces. I wonder what Van Gogh thinks of this exploding. <laughs> this is Van Gogh. Not sure who those two are. This is of Leonardo da Vinci. Oh, and this piece I know. Oh, so nice to touch it. This space is so bright. Let's see what's down here. I like how those pieces look like they continue each other. Maybe in different seasons. Wow, this one is beautiful. Portrait of the Comatis, Berlin and all daughter. This drawing I also know. 
Okay, in and we found Van Gogh sunflowers. Oh, I love the colors. Wow, the crops are amazing. And of course, the sunflowers. This looks painful. Wow, I know this painting as well. We learn about it in the history of art class. I never knew it was that big. I love the colors and the composition. Very pretty. You should not put birds in a cage. Oh, wow. This earth is beautiful. I also like that it's like in a vacuum and a clean background. Oh, cozy. Oh, this is beautiful. Sir Thomas Lorenz, portrait of Charles William, the red boy. Wow, gorgeous color. This is so big. Okay. It's 4.15 right now, so let's look for the exit. Okay, we found it. It's a way out. It's so cold in here. Ah, here we go. So pretty. Sorry, one step on your face. This is the balcony I saw earlier. So here they have like a frozen yogurt store. Mm. Ah, here it is, the orange store. Cut and squeeze. So right now this is the only vegan food there. It's with blueberries and lemon cheesecake. Okay, so here's the cake. Look how pretty it is. They have the Ben and Jerry shop here. I need Wi-Fi to find my way back. Wow, look at this restaurant window. So many sweets. Mm, I just ate a cake, but I'm very tempted to go inside and see if they have any vegan one. Let's see. It's called E L and N. Okay, 
guys, so I'm here and they have the vegan chocolate and hazelnut, uh, which is the only one vegan. Fortunately, but I'll try it. I'm gonna take it away. So I'm going to the bathroom. I think this is the most never and stale staircase I ever been in. Oh, it's like children's staircase. <laughs> if it doesn't feel the whole way. Okay, everything's so pink. It's like made for Barbie. I wonder if the toilet is pink. No, what a disappointment. Okay, so it's my takeaway. Okay, so it's time to go to the back and since I'm quite tired after walking today for like five hours, I'm gonna take the underground tube right there. So this is the line I need to get, the central line, and here I have the oyster. First time I'm gonna use it. Yay! So exciting! This is the lounge area. So I only need electricity for my laptop and I can walk from here. Such a strong vinegar smell. Oh, such a strong chocolatey smell. Oh, yay, it survived the trip. Okay, let's eat. Itadakimasu. <laughs> drier than the first one I tried. So yeah, I think the first one, the vegan cheese and raspberry one was better. Not much taste of chocolate, more taste of the nuts. Mm. Which I don't find, but the texture of the cake as well is a bit more dry. Let's try with the cream. Let's see. 
like this. What is this? Nah, I pick it up. Hmm. It's really nice. Turkey is really good, but not fresh hazelnut. Like hazelnut, you put in the freezer and then take out, and it gets its bright red too. 